Yo, what's good everybody? We back again with another Kalanos food. Still on the lockdown, you know what it is already. I don't gotta explain it. Today, we're gonna hit up 7-Eleven. If you don't know already, 7-Eleven is on every block in Thailand. The 7-Eleven is everywhere. People go to 7-Eleven for everything, to pay their bills, to get meals, to snacks, drinks. 7-Eleven is a fucking way of life in Thailand. For my years working in the club as an MC, 7-Eleven is always the go-to midnight snack spot. You can go pick up all types of gems they have in there. They have meals that you can microwave, they have like sausages, sandwiches, all types of snacks and chips. They got everything at 7-Eleven, it's 7-Eleven. Today I'm gonna show you some of my favorite things that I get over there, so when you come here, you can cop them or just look out for them. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, make sure you hit the bell, and make sure you stay locked. Kalanos Food, let's go, 7-Eleven. Ding, 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 ding. You're probably thinking, 7-Eleven? Why the fuck this dude just do an episode on 7-Eleven? But look, Thailand ain't your normal 7-Eleven. We talking meals, snacks, drinks, produce, liquor, pharmacy. You can even pay your bills at 7-Eleven. Get familiar, cause they got these shits on every block out here. All right, so we just made the 7-Eleven trip. I'm here with my uh, my wifey. Beautiful wife. Yeah, she's all right. I'm gonna start off with my my favorite. All time favorite. Right? My all time favorite is the is the ham and cheese. So yo, it just it just comes in this in this sleeve right here. So it's simple as shit. You know, it's like it's just white bread, mm -hmm. sliced cheese, and uh, ham. Crack it in the middle like this. Open it up. See, oh shit, my cheese is drippy. God damn, that shit good every time. It's some simple shit that you would think you just make at home, but it's just so damn good. <laughs> I mean, like at 5 a.m. in the morning after the club, this is like it was like heaven. It's like life. So actually, anything you get in 7-Eleven that's in the cooler, you can ask them to warm it. We have, we have your favorite sausage too. The cheesy bites. Same thing. You can eat them cold, or you can ask them to warm it for you. See, so, yeah, you come in these. Little pack that you just throw, they chuck it in the microwave, and you got this little wooden stick. So basically, it's, it's a pork sausage stuffed with cheese in the middle. You can ask for sauce too. They have like mayo or chili sauce or ketchup. <laughs> mm. Yummy. Another all time favorite this is like more if you're Thai, you tend to get uh, <laughs> the cup noodles. There's so many different types of cup noodles in Thailand. Today, we got one in 7-Eleven where we cooked it right there with the warm, with the hot water. And we want to try the spicy cheese. Here, spicy cheese, now you can see it. You ever had this one before? No, first time. So my tip to you new cup noodles, don't put too much water in it. It'll be like bland. That shit will have no flavor yeah, if you put too much water in your mama. There's like a line in the cup that you can see. It shouldn't go over that that line. Yeah, there you go. There you go. There you, you go. See the mama inside. Man, I thought I could eat until I met my wife. She put me on to all types of shit. She abusing the fuck out of them noodles. Show me who's boss, baby. Whoa. <laughs> it's not spicy like the name says, but it's definitely like a little cheesy. Don't sleep on this spicy cheese, bro. This shit hit different. Pretty good, right? <laughs> Yo, it's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was really skeptical about spicy Cheesy. cheese ramen. It was pretty good. Because like I thought creamy? I would be in the bathroom right after I ate it, but it's actually, it, it actually, it actually reminds me of ramen, like a creamy ramen. Yeah, it's like a little creamy. I think it's pretty good. Yummy, 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 spicy cheese mama in my tummy. I mean, the good thing, like, you'd never go hungry in Thailand. There's always food, regardless, like, street food. Yeah. But if you find a 7-Eleven, like, you're good. I got this, this flavor I've never had. I think this is new, actually. Korean cream cheese garlic. Mian Kham flavor. It's like a, um, like an appetizer. It looks kind of like, like this. Oh. Oh. Good? Where oh, yeah. Garlic, right? 
for me, mm -hmm. cream cheese, garlic. Hold up. This might be my new favorite potato chip. Cheese. It kind of tastes favorite. like garlic bread. It does it taste like garlic bread. Mm -hmm. All right. You don't find that many chips that kind of have that lime aftertaste. Oh yeah. Right? It's super limey. What? I love that. If you want to try something new, like go for some of these Thai flavors. All right, so we also got this. Sushi roll, crab meat, and um, some, um, like a mayo sauce. Sushi roll from 7-Eleven. Meanwhile, you are Kalanos food. I am Kalanos dessert. This is definitely one of the favorite ice cream that you can get. It's, um, what is it called? Polite Milk Flavored Dark Chocolate. See? I better get my bite in before she kill this whole damn thing. They have this outer shell with chocolate, an outer shell, but it runs through the middle of the, the ice cream also. So you don't only get the crunch from the outer shell, you get little bits of crunch in the middle of the ice cream. Yeah, like that. Mm. Ooh, it's focused, man. <laughs> I told you she ain't playing. Cakes in 7-Eleven. So caramel custard pudding. I never had this before, actually, but it looked good. So we thought we'd try it. Pop. Since we don't have a spoon. Okay, here, here, here. We have a fork. Nah, right, fuck it. You gotta do what you gotta do, so. This mama fork is gonna have to work. So. Oh! Good? Yo, that's fucking delicious. It reminds me of a, a creme brulee, but without the, the brulee on top. It was at this point that she realized I wasn't exaggerating. It was that damn good. Mmm. Like, pretty smooth. And the custard is smooth. The caramel is nice. Makes sense. Mmm. I think we should get a couple more. <laughs> <laughs> I told you it was good. <laughs> Make sure you try these gems that we recommend. And I swear you won't be disappointed. Or if you don't want to try what we're telling you to try, just go in there and just pick up whatever you want to get. And I'm sure you'll be content and happy with whatever. Yep. But definitely, 7-Eleven is a spot that you need to get familiar with if you're ever coming to Thailand. Yeah. So thank y'all for watching. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you share. Make sure you hit the bell and make sure you stay locked every week to Calanos Food. I'll see you next week. Say bye, baby. Bye bye. <laughs>